fucking intro. Sully. Now this movie stars Tom Hanks and is directed by Clint Eastwood. How could you go wrong? Now I know the story of the flight uh, 1549 and how it went down on the Hudson River and stuff like that. But that didn't take away from me wanting to see this movie. I mean it's Tom Hanks and you know it's directed by Clint Eastwood. But the reason why I still wanted to go and see the film is because I was hoping that I would find out more things you know that I didn't really already know about the whole situation. And they do a good job on delivering that because any movie that's based on a true story, you can automatically know what's gonna happen if you just look it up. And and I like movies that are based on real life events where they add more stuff to it that you didn't already know before. So you actually learn stuff while you're watching the film. Please don't mess up on this Tupac biopic. Now Tom Hanks, of course, does a good job of embodying the character of the captain that was on the flight that day. He really brings the captain back to life. And the dude's not dead. Oh, he's not? No, he's, 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 okay, he's, he's doing well. He's rather well. But not only do they talk about the flight in death and what actually happened, what what caused what. Now I didn't know how this film was gonna be. I didn't know if it was gonna start from like the beginning of the day all the way till you know the ending would be when the plane crash happened and then a little bit of stuff afterwards. But no, it actually takes place after the whole events of the plane crash. Because after the incident, there's some other stuff, legal stuff that they had to get into, which I had no idea about. The movie of course has to do with the plane crash, but it more revolves around like the psychological issues that he was going through after the events if you haven't seen the movie yet and you're debating if you want to see it because you already know like what happened that day with the Hudson and stuff like that I think you should still check it out because they actually add some stuff that you probably didn't even know about like the ending there's a scene at the ending and it's like they're in a it's like a courtroom or something and they're showing evidence to prove a certain something and when that certain something is proved wrong it's so satisfying it's so satisfying but like i said this is always my opinion and i liked it so out of five bucket hats i give it 